Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're checking out the Russian Badger for the first time. Let's get straight into it. Just so you know, this video is sponsored by Opera GX. <laughs> oh! I'll tell you more in just a couple minutes. Put the gnome away, Master Chief. You don't need it. You don't I'll need it. it. It's a stupid it. achievement. Let him finish the fight. Is that bad? <laughs> <laughs> Elmo? <laughs> oh my god, is that canon? That the Arkham Knight saved Master Chief from Elmo <laughs> while carrying a gnome Bro. for the achievement? That's what the game worst is this? YouTube clickbait title you could ever imagine. Arkham Knight saves Master Chief from Elmo in front of Shrek while carrying Shrek. no? Not clickbait <laughs> gone wild? Sponsored <laughs> by Rage Shadow Legends? Buy a Ridge uh -huh. Wallet? <laughs> Oh I download source, babe. <laughs> I'm stuck. Welcome to the greatest horde shooter ever, Left 4 Dead 2. Game where, oh, you know what? I think I read that wrong. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna take that one again. Welcome to the second greatest horde shooter ever, Left 4 Dead 2. A game that usually starts like, oh, oh. shooting zombies with guns is fun, and usually ends True. like, I can't believe we shot Yoshi with a Smith & Wesson 500. <laughs> Not Yoshi. I'll admit that my dumb shit characterization of the game might be a little deranged given the number of mods is I wrote. Left 4 Dead 2 is a game where Otis from Barnyard kills Dallas and Big Dude. You fucking Benedict oh Arnold. Gosh. I'm riding with a turncoat. But if you'd like to see some of the worst mods ever made. Stop fucking shoving me, you prick. Played by some of the best players to ever play, and we're talking skip prom to grind Sigma male level players. Don't care. Fuck you, Catherine. Prom probably sucked anyway. I was grinding left for day. Bro. <laughs> I'd love to tell you about... <laughs> I'd love to tell you about Left 4 Dead 2. You gotta explain this to the world, Dad. Just before we get into things, thank you to Opera GX for sponsoring this video. The world's first gaming web browser that's so awesome, it makes me want to explore. You see, unlike oh. other web browsers that steal your- Can we talk about, like, his animations are amazing. Like, I wonder, does he, like, wear a mocap suit to do all of this? And the edits are amazing also, like, it's- the first two minutes was just extreme, bruh. I love it. Computers, RAM, and resources. Give me your f***ing RAM. Get away from me, you goddamn d. It has GX control that allows you to limit how much Excuse RAM, me? CPU, and bandwidth it's using so gaming and browsing simultaneously doesn't set your computer on fire. And unlike other browsers that flashbang you with white backgrounds every time you open them. You can customize the color theme and I'm force dead. dark mode on every page, so you won't have to visit the eye doctor anymore. Though he is a pretty cool guy. Yavon. It's even got dank integrations like GX Player for your favorite music service, Twitch to see when your favorite streamers are live, and Discord for anybody sliding and or stampeding into your DMs. <laughs> I know oh. change is hard, but Opera makes it easy with quick imports. Bad Bring dang. all your settings like bookmarks and passwords over from Chrome and even a mobile version for syncing files, videos, and links. <laughs> Download Opera GX via the link below and get my very own custom color theme and background so you can browse and game like never before. I'm no astronaut, but that sounds like a pretty smart idea. Thanks again to Opera GX for sponsoring this video and getting me away from Google Chrome. Left 4 Dead 2 is a game where four survivors of a zombie apocalypse rushing to catch a helicopter evac are, you guessed it, oh shit, uh, Left 4 Dead. Yes, Left 4 Dead. Oh, I'm still here, honey! I thought they were supposed to be getting us out of this shit. Okay. Helicopters don't come back when you yell at them. Valuable lesson. You three tuck that away for later. Now grab a weapon and follow me. This goddamn true, building's true. on fire. Which means fighting your way out in search of a new salvation is your only option. Whether that be a busted ass boat, the military, or maybe even another helicopter. Looks like the Whirly Bird was heading to the mall across town. Helicopter! It is a helicopter! You call that thing a Whirly Bird one more time, I'll beat you so bad, your sister's gonna wish she never gave birth to you. Obviously, this isn't a dream Bro? team of zombie killers, but at what least you've got Coach, Bama? the dependable positive one that's always ready to get a cheeseburger or give some words of encouragement. Come on now, let's just get through this shit. Rochelle, the news producer, is cut from the same friendly and considerate cloth who's probably the greatest woman on earth because she's probably the only woman left on Earth. Hey, I'm here. <laughs> Ellis the Mechanic is a storytelling lyricster that, that most people find call me stupid, but I beg to differ. You say naive, I say useful in an apocalypse. Just a car. Just a car? That's like saying the Mona Lisa is just a sculpture shit, man. That's like saying Jimmy Gibbs is just a driver. That's like saying the girl on the bridge is just a little pretty. You know what I like best about your stories, Alice? The sound they make when they stop. And of course, Nick, the former con man gambler that's whiny, sarcastic, and never impressed by anything ever. But don't let his harsh demeanor fool you, because underneath that fistful of rings and $3,000 suit, 
He is a real piece of shit. That's great. I run into the three. <laughs> Wait, I thought he was going to say something totally different from that. <laughs> people in Georgia not carrying a gun. With these four, you'll be fighting your way through the South after every possible lifeline that can save you, including helicopters, boats, and bridges, with plenty of safe rooms along the way. I'm telling you for the last goddamn time, lower the goddamn bridge. You greasy vest wearing monkey. And if you really want to get broke, fancy pants tactic. We don't have time well, for this shit. Vegeta. All right, fine. So, how yeah, does a reasonable freezer. story like this suddenly involve goofy, unrelated shit like shooting Yoshi with a 500 Magnum or Iron Man whipping out a Glock 19? <laughs> I still like to think that when Iron Man runs out of all munitions, he just pulls out a Glock 19. <laughs> Mods. Basically just mods, but if we're getting technical, the workshop, because in your average horde shooter, it would take a shit ton of work to swap out one of the main characters for someone like Arthur Morgan. Yeah, oh, just the fact that Rochelle is like mini Arthur Morgan. Where's our money? I don't speak German either. Everybody gangsta till Arthur Morgan starts banging Thanos. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Smokes 12 packs no, of cigars to build up dead <laughs> But this since is this amazing. is a Valve game on the Source engine, <laughs> what in the multiverse of madness is going on here, brother? It has access to this wonderful thing called the Workshop, which allows you to add maps, weapons, characters, or any other mod you want. Hell, the model I'm wearing right now is from the Source Filmmaker Workshop, and so is this. And so is this. You want both your fists to suddenly Shout turn into loaves of bread? Man. Bang! Straight off the workshop. And I'm not gonna say that everything on the workshop is a good idea, but god damn it, is it ever frictionless to equip? Why the fuck would you want Hitomi from Dead or Alive 5 as Francis? <laughs> And once you start clicking this button, you can't stop clicking this I'm button. Done. With Rochelle, Coach, Ellis, and Nick transforming into Pickless Cage, Battletoad, Doomslayer, and Isaac Clark. So you can turn you it to anybody at this point. <laughs> You have to be green. You must be green to be in this squad. I'm yeah, done. Right. I'm, I'm a Bro, you're a battle toad. I'm battle toad. <laughs> Thanks, Pickless Cage. You're welcome, citizen. <laughs> I think you get the mod situation now. Me click green button, me turn thing that looks like this into thing that looks like this. Fucking brilliant. Let's move on to the bad guys, because no matter what they <laughs> look like, and no matter what you look like, you're still gonna need to kill them if you hope to survive. Your cloaker. Oh, please! Oh, I got him in the wall! What the fuck? came up from the there? depths and punched him into outer space. The horde comes first because they are everywhere all the time. And I know a single zombie isn't scary, but you're facing hundreds per chapter and thousands per campaign. I don't care if it's cheeseburgers, coaches, or regular ass plain Jane zombies. A thousand of almost anything is terrifying. Hamburgers? <laughs> oh, you gotta chill. Hello, yes, Gabe Newell. I would like to turn your game into a fucking hodgepodge of whatever I think of. Fuck <laughs> Out of my way, coach, you too, Shrek. My friends call me coach. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> coach has wow. one weakness other than chainsaws. The Mossberg 680 from Modern Warfare. <laughs> the special infected are where it gets interesting, because unlike basic ass regular zombies that are dumber than dirt, these guys can pin you. And please, Games Workshop, please, please, please don't sue me for making this joke, but uh... Brother, I am pinned here! This means that once they've grabbed a hold of you, they aren't letting go until either a teammate saves you or you're down on the ground bleeding to death. Jeez. And although all four special infected do the same thing, they've each got a unique technique. Playing the violin. Jingle? I happen to prefer the piano version myself. <laughs> that means a hunter is nearby, a hoodie wearing Superman that can leap over buildings and into your rib cage in a single bound. He's by far my favorite. <laughs> Scary, I know, but Bro. he's super squishy and loves making loud noises before and during his jump. Ah! So no matter if it's a Cloaker, Elmo, Kermit the Frog, or Chuck E. Cheese, you'll hear him coming. <laughs> oh my god, that's so this, scary. I got this, bro. Watch this. Good no one. Problems. Good one. <laughs> bro, I've been up and down. Does he have a doge as an aim pointer? Long haul game, my guy. Tickle that, Elmo. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna die alone, aren't I? <laughs> oh my, this that sound. Insane. Thanks, Spider-Man from PlayStation 1. <laughs> Look who the hunter is. <laughs> it's Charles Entertainment Cheese. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, oh my god, bro. Charles oh. 
No! Get, get, get me off of Siren Head, please! <laughs> Thanks, Batman. You this too, Sanic. You really are a true friend. That's not my meme. That's Oscar on Twitter. He calls him Charles Entertainment Cheese instead of Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> Bro, it is Charles the Entertainment Cheese the third. The first brother died in the war. Put some respect <laughs> on his name. It's Charles Entertainment Cheese. I'm gonna melee you. <laughs> oh, I did not. That did not work. <laughs> I am a genius. Oh, no. The smoker is far less intimidating, which may explain why I've got hours of badass hunter footage and like 10 seconds of smoker footage. Imagine running around the map killing uh, Kermit the Frogs. You see, even his jingle sucks, but I guess that fits because slurping is sort of his thing. He wraps you up with his long ass tongue and reels you in from a distance, Japanese Spider Man style. No, I'm getting smoked! No, 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 Bing, Bing, right click me, right click me. Smoke! No, it's, it's, it's Japanese Spider Man was pulling PS1 Spider Man from Neverstar. It's literally the meme of the two Spider Man pointing at yes, each other. Yes, literally the meme. Getting a little more in your face, <laughs> jockeys loud. will hop on your back and ride you like Seabiscuit, wrangling you in any direction they want, which makes them a real bitch to get off. But he's especially easy to hear with his never-ending maniacal laughter, which is why I usually make him the Green Goblin. You're boring <laughs> me, Spider-Man! Spider-Man! Nah, this is too epic. I'll get you, Spider-Man! Chargers are the 10th prestige veterans of beating their meat, with right arms the size of tree trunks ready to rock you like a freight train and smash you in a ground chuck once they come to a stop. Your Why is his arm that big, either, bro? Because even if he's grabbing somebody else, he can still truck other survivors backwards while sending his main target into a wall, off a ledge, or screaming off a bridge. So it's best to avoid his hummel, like what I would do to a sandwich if I really wanted to get it in my mouth fast. You know what I mean? I don't actually pummel sandwiches. Badger's like a wood chipper. I do. Badger legitimately oh. goes into <laughs> I got him. Donkey I got him. Kong, I come bro. into the room. I see an illuminated Doge face. On. Bro, when Miles get a hold of a game, it's a wrap. A Donkey Kong <laughs> beating the meat off of me. <laughs> He's off the bridge, right? Oh, you're off the bridge, Spider-Man. Oh my God. Oh, my God. Look out. see the crab? Oh, I heard him. Oh my god! <laughs> Ain't no way, boy. <laughs> that was scary as shit. These four pinning special infected are supported by boomers, these bile filled balloon zombies ready to vomit all over you or explode upon death. Ew. Leaving you partially blinded and a mouth watering target for a horde of zombies. So if you happen to see Otis from Barnyard, make sure you blast his ass from a distance. <laughs> oh my god, it's Otis! <laughs> Show yourself, you coward. I'm gonna set you on fire. You have an M4 Asimov. <laughs> Otis, come back here. <laughs> Otis! <laughs> Look at the way he runs. Counter terrorist <laughs> win. I killed him with a Minwear Asimov M4, as God intended. Hearing the dozens of boomer voice lines from the survivors in our modern political climate never gets old. This game truly was ahead of its time. We got a boomer! Oh man, that sounds like a boomer! Leave it alone, leave it alone, just leave look, it alone. I'm just looking. Leave it alone. Just like right. being at the zoo. Oh, it's an exhibit. What? We have it for you. How about around the go? I oh. couldn't stop! <laughs> oh my god. I had the Smith no & Wesson 500 bone crusher. Of course I was gonna do it. God damn it. God damn it. You Why can't just put up? Otis from Barnyard on the other side of some glass and a Smith & Wesson 500 bone crusher in my hand. Bruh. And not expect That's me to crazy. blow his cow That was, that head was literally neuron activation. <laughs> Spitters are the other supporting special infected that basically spit Mountain Dew Molotovs and noxious acid at you and are definitely difficult to hear but have the most memorable the tune. Venom? And they also have a tendency to crash my game anytime I try to mob them. So for some weird reason you were specifically excited about me blasting spitters in the mouth? <laughs> I've got some bad news. Four specials that can pin you, supported by two specials that can impair you, are rounded out by two boss special infected that are on opposite ends of the spectrum. The witch is a teeny tiny crying woman that can insta down you if you disturb her with damaged light or even prolonged eye contact. So either. So basically, he's like explaining what the game is like and what it's like with mods. <laughs> I feel like mods really make the games a lot better because they can. Manipulate the game however they want to. But I'm really loving this content. Y'all let me know in the comments what other videos y'all want to see me react to. Nuke her ass into oblivion with a flurry of damage or completely leave her alone. Wanna watch me fucking crown this witch? Love the rocket. Yes, I'll turn my flashlight off. 
<laughs> ain't no thing. <laughs> yeah, you ready? You ready? Oh, oh, we're nice just doing oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow, you just cut her in half. I can't believe that Arkham Knight just cut off Donald Duck's head with a chainsaw. It's fucking nuts. <laughs> it ain't much, but it's on its work. <laughs> and on the other hand, the tank, who unlike the witch, cannot be ignored. With such hulking strength, he can tear concrete out of the ground and <laughs> My boy skill lead day every day. Oh, that you slap you hundreds of feet off terrain and normally takes a whole team to kill. Oh no, oh no, I don't want any part of Robux? that. He wants his Robux, Batman. I'm he dying. wants his Robux. Oh god. This thing is fucked, right? There's literally nothing. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh, well. so that's not very cool. I know these nine nightmares don't sound like fun, but the weapons you have to obliterate them definitely are. Ranging from silly shit to deadly shit to silly deadly shit. There is nothing wrong with my AK, that's your monitor. Fuck you. Throwables are a great place to start with pipe bombs, molotovs, and boomer bile that can get you out of a jam and kill dozens in a single click. Though mine usually look like there. chickens, white monster, or mollies from Yes, go. Fire. Just go, bro. Just leave. Alright, I'm mauling mid. Oh god, pipe bomb. It's a fucking chicken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Fall no, guys? look at them. They just want the chicken. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there's a monster down there. I mean an actual <laughs> monster, not not the big <laughs> giant monkey. I mean like the monster energy drink. Go, Go get away. the monster doom guy. Oh, I, I trust you. I got this, Don bro. Hey, yo, call me on. <laughs> I am an amphibian. Oh, oh, fuck <laughs> oh, there's a smoker. No fucking way. No way. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, my yes, god you. into a spitter. Fuck this stupid fucking game. He's an amphibian. He needs to keep moist. Yes. With Bro. the ultimate liquid that provides moisture. Melee secondaries are available, and I know it may sound foolish to use anything but firearms in a zombie apocalypse, like, duh, Glock 17, go bang, bang. But these things are a godsend while you're surrounded. You won't friendly fire your teammates, which is a gigantic problem, by the way. You do that again, and I will bury you alive. And the mods are top notch. Excuse like, me? you mean to tell me that you don't want to kill zombies with a hyper beast karambit alongside Batman carrying a literal bat? Give me a fucking break. All right, this is like a <laughs> Yo, I got him with the karambit. Oh, another one! Another one! No one's oh safe. I hear Shrek. I'm getting this him with the karambit. Amazing. Does that sound good to you? Oh, no. oh, <laughs> Pickle his cage with the karambit. What will he do? You like my knife? Oh, way to go, Batman with a baseball bat. Couldn't have done it without you. They don't call me Batman for nothing. But the ultimate secondary has to be the Magnum Pistol, which is technically a Desert Eagle that I reskinned as a Smith & Wesson 500 Bone Collector that I mistakenly called a Bone Crusher like a fucking moron, but whatever. Any secondary with an eight-round capacity hey, that can one-shot any common infected on any difficulty he always has a place in my waistband. Oh, it's the Smith & Wesson. Smith & Wesson 500 Bone Crusher, or whatever it's called. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yo, get Yoshi! I got him with the 500 Magnum. I can't believe we shot Yoshi with a Smith & Wesson 500. <laughs> Yoshi, oh, man. Oh he don't deserve it. execute Yoshi like that, bro? Stop. Like, he don't deserve it. And primaries are totally off the rails, because even without mods, there's SMGs, pump shotties, auto shotties, assault rifles, battle rifles, grenade launchers, machine guns, dogs. They've got the sniper rifles from CSGO and Source. What else do you want? The best of the best! And with mods, oh anything gosh. is possible. Virtually anything. We're talking AA-12, ACR, and M82 Barrett from Modern War- Bro, this game's look amazing. I'm not gonna hold you. Fair too. I don't know how many of you remember 2009, but I'm pretty sure the ACR killed more people than car accidents that year. Rangers lead the way. Come here, Larry. Observe. Oh, you ran into a fire hydrant, you fucking moron! Bill died holding a Modern Warfare 2 ACR? It has such a loud sound. Oh, that's scary. You gotta move it! Otis, you rat bastard! Yo, Zoe with the Modern Warfare 2 M82 Barrett! Reloading! Oh, that and that crazy isn't even that fire. weird. When you can equip the shotgun from Doom 2 with authentic sound, melee, and reload animations, a couple guns from Modern Warfare 2 really isn't I that weird. <laughs> Thanks, Batman, for the friendly fire. I'll shoot that stupid fucking guinea pig for you. Guinea pig, guinea pig, guinea pig. Can I, can I, can I? Yeah! I hit him backwards. Hell yeah. 
very, very deep oh. double barrel shotgun. The Russian Badger has so many dope edits. It keeps you in tune through the whole video, you know? I cannot believe how many shells I can fit in here. Block me ice this fool. The robot character. Ice. Insane. Weird is what I did to my grenade launcher by taking an M79 thumper and turning it into a Pepsi can firing abomination that is entirely propelled <laughs> by men. That shit is weird. Yo, I that found it. Wild. Oh, check it out. It's a Pepsi launcher. It launches Pepsi cans with Mentos. Is Pepsi okay? <laughs> I need it. <laughs> it loads Mentos. I need that By the game. way, we were at this pizza place called Bojo's in Colorado with Goose. He asked for a rum and Coke. She asked if rum and Pepsi was okay, and he had an existential crisis at the table. <laughs> oh, it's Siren Head. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> no! Evelyn, I'll get him off. Just wait. Just wait. Kaboom! <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Chuck E. Cheese. Wow. Charles Entertainment oh Cheese got it. There it is! You found the propane tank! What you got there, Batman? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hit the bolt. Electro! <laughs> <laughs> Weird, it doesn't have to be weapons either, because pain pills and adrenaline shots, which give you temporary boosts like health and speed, can be turned into the most delicious drink on earth when you <laughs> The fact that they got a 2D Sonic character is so freaking wild. Exception of Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000, and I think you can guess what it is. Yes, I found the pills. You know what my pills are? This motherfucker Yo, got they have bees. physics! They have physics! Bee. They even Yo. jiggle around! Uh, that yes, is pretty wild. I'd like to file a complaint. I was halfway through dark carnival when I whipped out my beans and a bunch of zombies started pointing and laughing at me and said this motherfucker eating beans <laughs> please I would like to return your game right now why it's is it you just say the word oh, beans and then chat just erupts with this motherfucker eating beans <laughs> like immediately beans aren't even the end of the shit posting because minute details like your flashlight can be customized which I would definitely not recommend <laughs> what am I looking at you, know, yeah. v, you lost your schizophrenia medication oh my god my cheems are <laughs> tiny cheems look at you <laughs> oh but once you start equipping among us shit it's the beginning of the end like I, we made yo, our Kits into a mini Amogus, and there was no recovering. What in the world just happened right there? <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck was that? Amogus? Uh, shut the fuck. <laughs> Through my incredibly high tolerance for dipshit mods, I managed to find some real gems in the workshop, including Sanic as a two dimensional object. Oh my god, he's so <laughs> thin! <laughs> oh, he has the text on Come it on, too! Step it up. Oh my god. God, That's crazy. Rochelle. PS1 Neversoft Spider Man is cursed enough, yeah. but just seeing. <laughs> so wrong, man. You limping? Oh my god, you limping is disgusting. <laughs> is so I'm injured. I need some help. You got a problem? Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. I guess not. Battletoad is an obvious choice because much like my main man coach gaming, not to be confused with regular coach, he has no neck. How the hell are zombies gonna bite you in the neck when you don't have one? Exactly. Top tier choice. Win. Coach gaming. <laughs> Ain't no way, boy. This used to be a nice little Good thing I got my main man to back me up, Calvin. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh my god. His eyes that looks so and his neck wow. are so good, chat. What do you mean his eyes are good, bro? He is soulless. <laughs> Battle Toad woke up this morning and chose violence. There came a point where my shit posting crusade ran so deep, and I had so many mods running that I accidentally made my squad the Payday Gang without any animations, and I mean any animations. Geronimo, motherfuckers! They were stuck in the team like Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa! Oh my god! <laughs> That's crazy! Whoa, whoa! What are you doing? <laughs> I this is definitely what sleep paralysis is like. And Chad says I'm down bad, bro. I'm not down bad. I'm ascended, bitch. Bane, I'm missing my textures. Bane, 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 I didn't download Source. Bane, I'm stuck. Bane, what do you mean I need Gmod? That's how I revive you. What? 
You and I aren't so different, Badger. What am I looking at? You don't even swing. You don't even. You just <laughs> run into people. Thanks. Like you're just slaughtering the entire hallway without moving. I mean, you're moving laterally, but that's it. That's it. Yeah, nothing happens. You are just. The zombies like they're hacking. They're hacking. Standing there, spectating. Oh my god. Look at this dude. Look at him. Oh like, my like god. What is happening over there? <laughs> Yeah. 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 You are so Wow. Nah, Deadpool is perfect for this game. Perfection. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you just fucking despawned. Because you don't have any animations, you just were like a static pose just flying through the air. Please don't tell me we are dying here, bro. I At least Ben is gonna make you just jump in, bro. Just go. There's no way the entire payday gang died on the hospital. Oh, At the end, dang. Heavenly even showed us what a Sigma male grind set looked like by single-handedly countering a smoker, killing a tank, fending off hundreds of cheeseburgers, and rescuing Noam Chomsky that all at the same nothing. time. Right, just say when, I'll start oh, oh my god! You know the best part? That wasn't even me. <laughs> that was my stand. Oh, platinum! <laughs> Badger, I'm a Sigma male. I spent 6,000 hours on Left 4 Dead 2. I skipped prom. Sigma became male my, grind set. Became my own PE gym teacher. Turn that mindset into a grind set, Jimbo. Oh, shit! I'm done. <laughs> Yo, oh, I got him, I got him, I got him. <laughs> Once again, the Sigma male's being brought down by the betas Bro, around him. Let's play the, the game called Joe Rowe abandons all of his comrades. Just go, yeah, just go, just I'm go. a bit of a Sigma male. I told you. Oh, no! Oh, yeah! Oh my god, how did you get him? How did you get him? I'm at Chomsky! We're leaving! <laughs> Don't leave! We're... Oh, he can't beat up that never cheating Oh my god, you killed the tank? Just... It's like my worst nightmare. Jump! Jump two feet, you fucking idiot! I'm done. Come on! Get it off me! Oh, we got the achievement too. I owe y'all, Sigma male. Damn, have you actually got 4,000 hours? Turn that mindset to a grind set, brother. And now, after experiencing that level of zombie killing skill, along with some of the dumbest, most brain dead piece of shit mods that the workshop has to offer, I can finally say with complete confidence that Among Us is the worst. There is no meme. There is no joke. Making a survivor into an Amogus is despicable, and I'm glad he got repeatedly team killed by the Doom oh my I'm genuinely happy about it. Oh, happy about why it. are you I'm so like small? <laughs> Get away from me. Get away from me. Hold on, hold on. Get off of Short Kings out here. You feel me? <laughs> Get away from the giant oh Amogus Kings. They're so big. <laughs> why are they Germa? What the fuck? Why do you have an MP40? Why don't you? Yo, yo, get him, Mickey, get him! Oh my goodness, that world glass cave is Get wilding. him out of the ground! I live, bitch. <laughs> Come get this uh, bang. Come get this bang energy. <laughs> Why are you so fast? <laughs> fast is fast. Oh my God, uh, what are you doing to that AK? What if I need to back away from your ass? No, <laughs> don't do no that. Uh -oh. This is so terrifying. Who let you grab that? I'll fucking do it again. Why oh, you got such a fat ass, Mickey? <laughs> Bro. Yeah. Hey, I don't you. like that at all. Mickey, I fucking hate you. Yeah. <laughs> This has nothing yeah. to do with Left 4 Dead 2. I just want you to know I hate you. Do you know that something's wrong when Isaac Clark with an M1 Garand, a chicken, and a 1911 from Modern Warfare is the least weird thing that you've seen? I'm done. Why does Why he have a chicken on Why are you looking at the these? bean like that? You are just so intimidated. <laughs> Oh, don't worry, young one. I'll retrieve you. I owe you my life. I want you to know that Left 4 Dead 2 is an incredible game on its own without a single mod that I highly recommend you play, even if you don't have friends, even if you're just playing with AI. It's, it's still plenty worth it. Yeah, look, Ellis, all women are emotional wrecks who will eventually kill you, okay? Oh, shut up, Nick. What you saw here today no. is a completely warped version of the game because my brain just isn't capable of modding responsibly. <laughs> Most players build mods into the game to slightly enhance the experience, and I just can't do that. I was trying to make a version of Left 4 Dead 2 that was built different, and I ended up just making something that was built stupid. I'm just built alternatively. Constructed. 
alternatively. Constructed in an unorthodox fashion. Built stupid. Crafted without the preset parameters. I'm built parameters. different. I'm built different. I'm built incorrectly. I'm just raw in every way. <laughs> I should not exist. I should not exist. <laughs> and that's about it. I'd like to thank you so very much for watching. Please be sure to check out Left 4 Dead 2 if you're at all interested. And be sure to tune in next time when we revive Yoshi with Narcan. Just kidding. All the Narcan in the world is not going to save you from a round out of a Smith & Wesson 500. It's just not going to happen. Even if you are a fucking dinosaur. I'm done. Make sure I smack the subscribe. Let me know what other Russian Badger videos y'all want to see me do. And we out.